So we are going to be juicing today. up my life-saving friends it's your girl Shanice LaShine and we are back with another video um okay so this video a little different um so we are going to be juicing today um I've got all my equipment here I don't even think you can see it let me just turn this a little bit okay so I have my juicing machine um and if you remember my Amazon review haul that I did like a couple of months back I'll put it in the card or whatever so this is the juicer that I did a review on. It is not a top-notch juicer. It still passes like a, like some pulp and stuff, but it is not. It is it's not a top grade juicer, but it is a decent juicer that gets the job done. And I can't really tell the difference, so it works just fine for me. It is a Hamilton Beach juicer, and it literally is the bomb. It works just fine, it does its job, and it has no problems. So there is a pulp catcher in the back, this big bulky thing back here. I've put a trash bag already in there to make sure that my cleanup is not messy. And then you have the juicer part, and then you have the, whatever you call this, I don't really know what you call it, but the part where you push the fruit down and the juice go through. So I will be using two different um, containers because I used these a couple of months ago like maybe like three or four months ago I was very big on juicing and I saw so many different benefits with my water <laughs> I saw so many different benefits from juicing just weight loss um, just my skin everything so like I was saying if you watch me on social media it is time to go back on a juicing detox because for one I am bloated I'm sluggish my skin is like breaking out and it's just time for me to get back into it and it's thing I have different recipes that I'm going to be doing I'm gonna try and juice enough so that way I can do a three-day juice detox literally drink nothing but juice I have this container like I was saying and then I also have the glass jars because I ran out of these I got these off of Amazon and I'll put the link down below where I got these and then these came from Michaels they were like two dollars a piece and I got like ten of them so you can do that so that is that and then to save time I have went ahead and already prepped a lot of my fruits and vegetables that I will be using in my juice and I will if I can try to put a video in of everything just kind of laid out to kind of show you everything that I did buy and purchase so everything is already pre-prepped and everything just to save time for the video because that would make the video twice as long so with that being said let's get to juicing so we're gonna start with a green juice that consists of spinach cucumbers green apples and celery we need some apples green celery spinach and what else did i say child this is me every day and cucumbers child look at here this is not the time to be forgetting stuff and cucumbers and like I said, I have already like sliced up a lot of this stuff to where I can literally just put it in the juicer and go. All right, so let's do this. I'm trying not to like, hold on. All right, let's see. I don't want to put my back towards y'all while I'm doing this. And it gets really loud also. Um, this juicer does anyway. It's not like a silent juicer. It does get pretty, pretty loud. All right, so in order for me to be able to put it in here, I do have to use a smaller cup um, with these type of containers, but for my mason jars, they'll slide right up under. So just for the time being, I'm gonna start using these um, because these are more of a recyclable, I can throw these away or I can wash them out, so really doesn't matter. All right, so typically I like to start with the base, which is usually my spinach. Start with the spinach and this is already supposed to be pre-washed and everything so you don't necessarily have to wash it off so we're gonna turn it on
Okay, so I don't know if you can see it. Try not to waste it. But here is my spinach juice. So that is my base. Um, all right. So usually that take that was about three handfuls of spinach. Um, so I try not to use as much, but my apples will make up for it. My cucumbers will make up for it, and um, the celery will also make up for it in juice. So uh, let's move on to the cucumbers. So I'm probably going to use about two cucumbers or a whole cucumber all together. the apples so I'm probably gonna do half apples oh, half apples probably gonna do half of a granny smith apple um okay so I think it's done all right so here is the juice with the cucumbers and so far it smells really good like so good okay apples are next celery is so like the taste of it is so potent I normally do not use that much celery um, unless I am just drinking straight celery juice or celery is my base so I'm only gonna use two celery stalks for this um, and then sometimes I do have to go back and add different ingredients to kind of either make it more sweeter or more bitter depending on you know how I want it to taste so after this is done we'll taste it so we're like halfway through with this cup so by the time I put these two celeries in there this cup will be full for sure all right see this is why when you juice wear something that you don't really care about because now I got juice everywhere I got celery juice everywhere all right, you just going like ain't nothing wrong. I'll clean it up in a second. Blend the juices together. It is definitely a green juice. All right, let's see. Cause I may have to add something else, so let's see. Maybe a couple more apples. Um, okay, so let's add more apples because I taste the cucumber, definitely taste the celery, the spinach, and I the spinach. So I'm gonna get this froth off also. You can leave it, it's not bad, but I don't really like it because it makes it all foamy tasting. So I'll try to take that off. All right. Okay, now let's taste it. That's it. That hit. That's it. Okay, so I ended up using pretty much almost the whole apple. I think I used like six or seven slices. So, they hit. Okay, okay. All right, so, okay. All right, okay. So that is the green juice that we got. So I'm probably gonna make some more of those. Maybe like one more of those, so at least I can have two of these. I made some of them off camera just to save time. But um, I have 12 in total for, for three days. So here are all 12 of the juices that we made. Um, I labeled the top of them and then wrote down the recipe so that way I know exactly what I'm drinking. Um, because juices do taste different once they've kind of sat for a day or so and kind of like marinated. So I just wanna make sure I know what I'm drinking. So if I do like that recipe, I can actually make it again. Um, because like I said, juicing is something that I used to do just about every week with my weight loss journey. And with that being said, that is a wrap for this video. If you enjoyed this video, make sure that you give it a thumbs up and let me know that you enjoyed it. So that way I know if you guys wanna see more content like this with my juices. Um, also, if you have a recipe that you think that I would like or if you tried juicing before and you just wanna like exchange some recipes, hit your girl up in the comments down below. Let me know, okay? Um, but other than that, I will see y'all later and I gotta go get some stuff done.